hello everyone welcome back to the channel uh, in today's video we are going to discuss uh, a set of questions called gameplay analysis from lead code so what we are going to do is i will solve these four questions okay and i will put time how much time it took for me to solve these four questions and i will put in the in the comment box what you have to do we will discuss the questions first now and what you have to do pause the video and try yourself i will put a create and insert a statement in the description box and see the time how much time you took and post in the comment section whoever three persons with the fastest uh, query time i will post uh, those names in the in my community post okay so i have not sol solved these questions before so first for the first time i will be solving those but before you go and solve let's understand all four questions so that it is clear and then you can start uh, writing the queries okay so here's the game players analysis there is only one table in this question okay so there are different players who play games right so if you see player id 1 he has played two games again player id 2 again player id 3 and they have event date on which date they have played the game okay hope it is clear and it is number of games played like on the uh, the player id 1 on 1st of march played five games and similarly so the first question is write a sql query that reports the first login date for each player so player id 1 first login date is this one for player id 2 first login date is this he logged in only once and for player id 3 first login date is this so this is the first question second question is write a sql query that reports the device that is first logged in for each player so each player which is the first device id they have logged in first so for the player id 1 device id will be 2 for player id 2 device id will be 3 and for player id 3 device id will be 1 the first device id they have logged in right so these two questions were in easy category in lead code and these two next two questions are in intermediate ones okay so these two will be little complex so let's understand these two that is SQL query that reports for each player date and how many games played so far by the player. That is the total number of games played by player until that date. So it's kind of cumulative sum. So for the player ID 1, on the first date he played 5 games. On the second time when he played, he played 6 games. So for this row output should be 5, for this row it should be 11. Similarly for different players we have to find the cumulative sum. This is the third question. And fourth question is write a SQL that reports the fraction of players that logged in again on the day after they first logged in. So we have to find players who first logged in and immediately next day also they logged in. So we have to find percentage of those players. For example, if you say player ID 1, right, he logged in on 1st March and then immediately he logged in on 2nd March also, which means he, he is qualified for that fraction in the numerator, right? Second player logged in only once, so it doesn't matter. Third player logged in on 2nd March, but he didn't log in on 3rd March. He logged in on July, so he is not qualified. So our answer should be 1 player divided by 3 players, right? We have to find fraction. So out of 3 players, only 1 player is qualified where on the immediate of day of the first date, he played again, right? So our answer will be 1 divided by 3, 0.33%. So now... You can stop now. I will put the questions in the description box as well. Okay. And what I'm going to do, I'm starting my uh, answers now. So I will, I, I'm noting down the time and then in the comment box, I will put the, uh, my timing also. And then you can also put your timing. Okay. I'm starting now. So first question is that is, uh, it is simple. I just have to say player ID, comma, minimum of event date. This will give me first time login, right? So by player underscore ID. Okay, so this is done. When was the first time they logged in? Okay. Uh, I need to see this table again. Okay. 
Put it ascending and uh, then select star from I will put this as sub query and then I will just filter where are then equal to one. So I will get select star from sorry okay. where are then equal to one right so i will get device id of each player when they logged in for the first time okay so this is done i think third question is write a sql query that reports for each player and date how many games they played so far by the player okay so i just need to i will just copy this and i need to find basically some of uh what is that column name games played okay sum of uh, games played okay sum of games played partition by player id right order by event date yeah this should give me answer so this is giving me cumulative sum basically if you see first game is five then he played second game so total game played is 11 again for this player id 2 i have only one so this is my total i will just rename is total played okay so 5 11 1 and then he played 0 and here he played 5 so 0 5 okay this is done let's move on to the final question uh, that logged in on the same day after their first login so so to get the first login i need to get the minimum event date so i will say with minimum date as select player underscore id comma minimum event underscore date as first date from activity by player id so for each player i will get the first date when he played now i need to check has he played immediately on the next day also okay so what i am going to do select from activity okay a inner join minimum date md on a dot player id equal to md dot player underscore id okay so from here what i will get a dot star comma first date okay let's see what we are getting here the dot player id what is wrong here okay this looks good let me run it okay this is fine so what i'm get, i i'm getting the first date also so this event date first date event date first date so if the difference between event date and first date is one then i can say that i can say that that player has played immediately after the first date so i will put where date diff date diff i need in days okay and first date is event underscore date 
comma first underscore date as equal to one so i should get only player one right let's see if this works uh, i'm not getting anything let me remove the filter and check again so event date and first date let me see what is the output of this Oh, it is minus one. Okay, so I need to do the words. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Hmm, fine. I need to remove this and I got player this one right sorry for the inconvenience so i got this player id one so he he logged in on second and he logged in on first also and immediately on second he logged in okay i hope questions are clear so i will clock my time see my comment box to to see how how many minutes i took you also post your answer and i will mention you in my next community post thanks for watching and subscribe to the